Did you know that there is a skyscraper that appears to have been lifted directly from a video game or that this Chinese building resembles one from the film Inception? Here is the list of the most weird skyscrapers in the world. Number 6. The Tulip The architectural firm in charge of this project, Fosters and Partners, plan to only use recycled water from irrigation for the building and on top of that, they were going to build a gondola ride to take visitors on an 8-minute loop around the skyscraper while construction was supposed to last. The Tulip in London will be 305 meters tall or about 1,000 feet and its floral shape was meant to be a unique addition to the London skyline. In fact, some Londoners believe the structure is too bizarre looking to be built, despite the mayor's claims that it would damage the city skyline. Fosters and partners are persevering, despite the fact that they are continually revising their strategies to persuade Mayor Khan and the rest of the city to approve this peculiar skyscraper. Number 5. The Aqua the Aqua is a building in the heart of Chicago that is around 859 feet or 260 meters tall. Each balcony is a unique shape to reduce wind shear and prevent birds from knocking into home windows. Architect Gene Gang wanted to design a residential building that looked completely different from the rest of Chicago's skyscrapers. She used irregular concrete slabs and stretched balconies to create the sculpture-like appearance. The building was named the Skyscraper of the Year in 2009 and awarded the Empress Skyscraper Award after two years of construction and $300 million. Number 4. CCTV Headquarters The headquarters of China Central Television, a state-run broadcaster known as Big Pants, are located in this next skyscraper in the middle of Beijing's Central Business District. It is 234 meters or 768 feet tall. According to architects Rem Kulhas and Ol Shireen, the CCTV headquarters features two leaning towers that finally comes together with the use of a perpendicular 75-meter cantilever. The unusual shape of the skyscraper is intended to represent the intricate and connected process of producing television. Number 3. Mahanakon Tower the Mahanakon Tower, one of Thailand's tallest skyscrapers, is about the same height as the Eiffel Tower at 340 meters or 1,030 feet tall. Designed to resemble a pixelated image from a video game, the tower cost $620 million to construct. In 2014, it was voted to have the best luxury condominiums in Southeast Asia. There are more than 200 residential units there, ranging in price from $1.2 million to $17 million. Additionally, the Skybar equipped highest viewing deck in Thailand. The view from one of these residential areas must be absolutely breathtaking. Number 2. Umeda Sky Building With two towers united at the top by an observatory with clear windows, the Umeda Sky Building, which was constructed by architect Hiroshi Hara in 1993, is among the top 20 highest skyscrapers in Osaka, Japan, towering at 173 meters or 568 feet, or about twice as high as Big Ben. Visitors can take in the full city's perspective and experience the brisk winds while traversing the donut-shaped rooftop. A restaurant themed after the Showa era of the 20th century can be found in the basement, along with a urban garden, theater, and art museum. On the floors above, Offices are available for well-known businesses like the automaker Mazda and the Consulate General of Germany has space dedicated to it. Number 1. One Central Park In the Australian suburb of Chippendale in Sydney, One Central Park was constructed. One Central Park features two towers connected at the base, with the taller of the two standing at 130 meters tall or just over 425 feet. The development was created to be innovative and environmentally friendly. Over 250 different plant species were used to build the intricate artwork, which cost over $1.6 billion. The tower's longest vertical gardens in the world stretch against the windows. The taller tower to the east also has a cantilevered heliostat dangling from the building's 28th floor that illuminates the common areas during the day and puts on an LED light show at night. So that concludes today's video. I hope you found it entertaining. Remember to like, subscribe, and comment in the space below. Stay tuned for our next video.